Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of No Man's Sky. Alrighty, when we left off, we had, well, we were not here, but uh, I had made my way to here from where my ship landed, and I brought my ship over here. So, we have to build a bunch of signal boosters, which is available right here. I'm going to make them my favorite color, because why not? Uh, got to make one right here. And... Time to use it. Outpost signal detection online. Navigation subroutines online. Exosuit upgrade unit detection online. Wait. You can detect those? Please select navigational task. If I have a drop pod coordinate data, I can decipher a thing. Okay. Uh, triangulate position? Alright, first beacon placed. Need to make my way to another triangulation site, which is off planet. Alright. Guess I'm going to be making a whole bunch of these. Wahoo. Alright, well, time to get in my ship and go. Please. Off I go to this next planet. I can't do it because I'm in the atmosphere. Damn it. How about now? Yes, I can. That oh, wasn't that far off planet. It's pretty much next door. Alright, time to slowly make my way in. already a structure here. Interesting. And there seems to be plants where they ought not be. Uh, Y'all need help with that? The electronic life form is agitated and perhaps in pain. Their body buzzes and small arcs of electricity jump between their mask and shoulders. They jolt and shake. They need help. Unknown life form. Corvax. Dub 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 dub. Okay. Um. I gotta check something real quick. Give me a second. There we go. Okay. Checked. Done. All right. They reach out a hand as if they want to shake mine. I instinctively raise my arm in response, but common sense advises caution. Now shake the hands. Okay. What did I do to myself? <laughs> okay. Power arcs from the life form leaping from their metal joints and flowing straight through me. The pain is intense. With the overload discharged, the Corvax looks far more comfortable. They waft away the smell of burnt flesh and present me with a gift. Well, I mean, thank you for paying me for taking the charge off your hands. Ow! That hurt. Bugger? All right. Take that, that's mine now. Um what was it uh Oh Movement module upgrade. Interesting. Interesting. Um Well I can add it to this. What'll it boost? Oh! Oh it boosts the jetpack jetpack tanks by a lot. 138%? And the recharge rate is boosted and the fuel efficiency is boosted. Wow. 
that is impressive. And I love it. <laughs> I actually love it. Um, hmm. Okay. Uh, let's... Did I already talk to you? Yes, I did. I did already talk to you. You just came in after I was... You really should not be in here. That's a weird thing. This... I don't know why this is here. The way it is, but it is what it is. Okay, well, uh, I guess... Since I'm here... Might as well do the triangulation thing. Oh, that's my capital ship. That's what that symbol was. Makes more sense now. Okay. Um. Nah. I don't need to save and chart here. It's not yet. Alright, let's build another one. But I need more metal plating and nanotubes for that. Okay. Well. If I need to make... Whoops. Accidentally select the wrong button. If I need to make three of these, I need to make sure I have a lot of them on hand then. That's what I need to do. Okay. Um, I'm just thinking... If I already have mag magnetized ferrite on my person. And I'm going to need a lot of it in the future. I might as well make some right now. That's why I have personal refiner built on my person. Makes it easier. Alright, um... Is there something inside here that allows me to do the thing I need to do? Oh, there is. Ah. I'm dumb. I stand at a terminal and watch a beacon from an unknown star endlessly play itself out on the screen. The pattern seems clear, but what to enter? 2738 Uh, well then, I think the next one would be 8273, because it seems they're just moving the number around to the back and progressing the number forward next. So, yeah, I think 8273 is next. I discover a location within the distant stars. Okay. Signal detected. Uh, a ruin. And, also, apparently, I have a new Corvax rank. Okay. Well, multiple things at once. Unknown coordinates received. An identified thingamabob. Okay. Well, in that case, I, um... I just want to make sure first that, that was... Okay, there was a second beacon that needed to be done, so I still need to do the beacon. That part is still true. Just, uh, not as true as I initially thought. Um, okay, build the second one. Oh, that looks like a lot of, uh, a lot of oxygen just sitting there. How much am I holding on to? Not enough. Okay. Well, I'll do this. Outpost signal detection online. Navigation subroutines online. Exosuit upgrade unit detection online. Triangulate position. Perfect. Ready for next position, which is apparently off planet, but possibly the same planet I used? Also, there's an ancient ruin on that planet, too. Interesting. Okay, well, um, since I'm here, I want to make sure I identify the oxygen I'm going to pull. Make sure that I have it in my databanks. 
and then pull all of this delicious, delicious oxygen. There we go. So much. So much in just a little area. But that gives me all that I'll need for a good long time. Beautiful. You gotta love it. You gotta love it. Alright, there was a... Oh, that's what this is. They look... Oh! Oh, they kind of look kind of cute. Look at that face. Look at that face. Oh, they're a kitty. They're a kitty. <gasps> oh, my God. I need to make creature pellets so I can make friends with it. I must. It's demanded of me. Look at you. Feed creature pellets to animals to, to calm or tame them. Friendly creatures can be mounted or farmed. They can also be adopted as a companion. Creatures can be fed directly or via the creature section. Bait thrown from the quick menu will calm predators or other angry creatures. Feeding of creature gains to their trust and allows them to be mounted or farmed. Adopt a creature to gain a constant animal companion. I can make you a companion! Curious about strange entities, so curious about me, obviously. Okay, extract berries. Leopard fruit. Well, that confirms that it's a kitty. Okay, leopard fruit. I kind of want to adopt you. Sopito. No, don't be sad. Get back here. Get back here. Don't be sad. Not allowed to be sad. Can't leave Pat. <gasps> I'm so hot. <laughs> I wish I could actually see my character patting them, but this is okay. This is good. I'm okay with this. Alright. Give you food. You can induce eggs. You can get an egg from them. Customize appearance. Cargo. Oh! You can equip them with stuff? File, vitals monitor, armor, solar battery, canteen. Huh. Cargo pack, satellite, support system, tapered plating. Torch, which I'm assuming is just flashlight. Square laser bio canisters. Vile. Kinda wanna just throw armor on it. And I can decal it? Throw decals on it? Oh that's cool. If only they would come in clearly. Okay. I put in numbers. Helmet. Galactic hub. Okay, and... <laughs> no. No, we're not doing that. We're not doing that. Nada. Polo. Apollo. Who's Apollo? Oh. Um, triad. No, that kind of looked cool. Spiral. Chevron. Oh, it's green. I like that. <laughs> I like that. Um, make this gray, maybe? Or maybe lighter gray. Nah, light gray. No, that's white, actually. That's why I say lighter gray. I'm dumb. Green. I can do the same thing to the other side. Okay. Alright. I'm going to be here for a bit. <laughs> I'm going to be doing this for a bit. Okay. Alright. I like it. Let's go. There we go. Creature has become your companion. You can adopt up to six? Companions can be summoned to accompany you on planets where they can help you find and collect resources. Feed, pet, and customize your friend by interacting with them. Well-nurtured companions may even lay eggs. Cool. 
I can... I can... I can ride on my shoulders. I carry nice friend gently. Oh, it talks to me. Oh, did you notice that? I can suggest directions with the left stick. Oh, I can suggest him turning. I'm sorry, I'm gonna geek out for like five seconds. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. This is the coolest. Okay, I'm sorry. Alright, alright, I'm sorry. I got a little too into that. Uh, companion register. Oh, so some of them are, are locked. Others can be unlocked by spending nanites. Well, I guess that makes sense. I don't like the name that it gave them, though. Uh, well, I, I, I like the second half, not the first half. So let's go with Pito. Let's call them Pito. Gender exotic. What the hell does that mean? <laughs> They're somewhat mischievous. They're very sweet-tempered and f somewhat free-spirited. Okay, that that makes sense. What that that what the what? I guess that name wasn't okay. By okay, fine. I guess. Um, not like I put puto or anything. I should put pito. All right. Uh. Uh, <laughs> PETA! Let's go PETA. Uh, how about that? Is that one allowed? I guess it's allowed. Okay, PETA! <laughs> okay, this is cool. This is very cool. But, should dismiss BAH! <laughs> BAH! You're a cat! <laughs> BAH! Alright, whatever. <laughs> okay, that was that was kind of nice. What? I don't have. Oh no, I don't have enough room for the stuff. Damn it. Okay. Um. All right. All right. If that's the case, I have no other choice. I do need to get rig it over here and all of that do all that stuff ever no I didn't didn't do that with this I did it for everything else but not with those interesting interesting all right okay well uh, I think I'm done with this planet for the time being Make our way to the other planet. Alright. Oh, pff, atmospheric interference. Okay, whatever. There we go. Yep, I was correct. It just goes right back to the planet I was on at Gucci. Just on a different half of the planet. But that's fine with me. And it's also near another building. And I am phasing through a tree. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, but it's a lot of carbon, which I kind of need right now. I was running a little low. Been running a little light on carbon lately. So I guess down the tweez go. I don't know why this one isn't... Okay. I have no idea why the laser wasn't making contact with it, but it's fixed now. Hmm. Is there other things around here? Oh, I definitely need one of these. I still wasn't all the way healed from the other thing. Alright, and microprocessor. Okay, cool. Cool. 
Well, I see some dihydrogen, which means I need to pick that up. Also, something that gives me carbon and oxygen. Might as well grab that, too. Cool. There's another one. Am I destroying the local uh, ecology a little bit? Yeah. For a good cause. Kinda. What the, the... What? These came out of nowhere. That's... That's shenanigans right there. Alright. Let's carve this one down. Okay. This wasn't here a second ago. Um... Okay. The game is placing trees where they weren't prior. Starting to wonder. Starting to wonder about... Oh, inventory... There's something. There's something that I'm missing and that pisses me off that I'm missing the something. Could be just as simple as like a crystal version of something, I don't know. But it pisses me off that I'm missing out on it. Wait, I've never identified this plant? To be fair, this plant wasn't here a second ago, but also... Oh. Star bulb. It's, you weren't here either. I'm calling shenanigans. Gonna harvest the oxygen out of this thing. And then also the carbon out of this thing. There we go. This gives me more dye? But why? Okay, can things stop phasing into existence around me, please? It's starting to feel like I'm surrounded by ghosts. Okay? <laughs> can we stop? Please. Alright. Okay. Alright, there we go. Got some projectile ammunition. Um let's do that. Then also Oh. Reload that. Then also also charge this. This good. Okay. That was a weird fluctuation. But whatever. Cryptid navigational data gave me actual navigational data. Who to thunk? Uh, where did it go? It went to cargo. Okay. Alrighty. Okay. Sodium. Alright. There's no one around here, but there is another computer. So, talk to the computer. A beacon flickers on screen, received from a distant point in space. My fingers hover above the terminal, ready to enter the code to reveal the location, but what numbers do I enter? Okay, so this is the same pattern as the last one. So, I'm going to assume it's 8390 because that proceeds the same way as the pattern previously. So yeah. I enter the digits and wait. The location of a distant point in space is revealed to me. And nothing is found. Okay. Well, at least I got some rank from the Corvax. That was all I got out of that. What you... Thank you. Jesus. Alright, um, these trees are also carbon, but I just noticed the note says hidden tentacles. I've seen enough hentai to know where this is going. Okay. I'm just going to get rid of some of these trees. <laughs> what is with the trees just popping up out of nowhere? Is this the his is this the hidden tentacle thing? Is this what they were talking about? It just pops up new trees out of nowhere? Is that what they're talking about? Jesus. 
Okay, and then there's hidden walls as well. It's also shenanigans. What in the tits, man? <laughs> okay. I'm just carving through all of these. Overheated. That was my bad. Alright, and a couple more in that direction. Okay. Is it done? Have I gone through all of them yet? Also, I'm not sure if this tree is. Okay, this is a real tree. Alright. Fair enough. Ow, you little bastard. How about eat laser, bitch? Alright. Whoa, 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 whoa. Only just noticed that thing there, but then also a tree phase right in front of it. It's gonna make it difficult for me to grab it either way. There we go. Good. Um, Okay, Gucci is haunted. I'm leaving. I, the Gucci's haunted. The Gucci's haunted. I'm leaving. Bye. Okay. Never mind, actually. You know what? I still hadn't done the other thing yet. So I kind of have to wait. Okay. Uh, grab all of these as well. Might as well. So I didn't think these were here either. But it's fine. Okay, got something out of that. Crystal, okay. Crystal fragment. Which gave me another storm crystal. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Alright, well, anyway. Have I already? Yes, I already cataloged that creature. Okay. Okay, so I know these things are murderous. I know those things are murderous. Oh, there's some pure ferrite. Interesting. Alright, anyway. I almost forgot again to do the thing again. Okay. Ow! That hurt a little. Okay. The last one. Triangulate position. Okay. Okay. And... Wait. I didn't have to make three separate ones. I could have just taken the same one with me for all of them. <laughs> I'm so dumb. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Reggie, cut all of this out. Cut all of it. No one can know. No one can know how stupid I am. <laughs> uh, damn it. Okay, return to space. Okay, how about instead we go to that ruin that's on the planet? And then I'll return to space. How about that? Ow! Shit. Okay. Okay. It's actually not that far. We're like four minutes away. That ain't too long a trip. Could easily do it from just uh, cruising on the planet. That ain't too bad at all. Might as well check it out. Just trying to directionally change this 
one hand, using my stomach to control the control stick while I'm trying to take a drink. I didn't I just put the drink down and do it by hand? Shut up, that's why. Shut up. gonna be too bad. Look, we got a little rainbow while we're doing it. A nice little rainbow while we're traveling along. Ain't it nice? Ain't it pleasant? Well, at least until the rainbow left. Oh! I knew that was gonna happen. I had a feeling. Alright. I guess I'm outrunning the sun because it's suddenly getting darker. Interesting. Oh well, we'll get there soon enough. Alright. We're almost there. Shouldn't be too much longer. <sighs> Sometimes it's just nice to fly above the planet and just look at the landscape of it, you know what I mean? Just something calming about it. Ah, look at that. We're almost at it. Just 20 more seconds. And then there's the big-ass honking tower to our left. Which I guess I could have gone to to... I guess, I don't know. Sell off some of my crap I'm holding. I could have done that. There we go. Perfect. Here we are. Time to do some running around. Destination reached. Knowledge stone. Corvax word for in. Okay. In what? The ancient marker hums at a frequency that burrows deep into my being, filling me with the voices of the Corvax echoes. Knowledge paves the way to understanding of probability. The Atlas spoken fragments. The Atlas interfaces are their shadows. The monoliths are their scattered children. Together they convey the wisdom of the infinite. They must be understood. Okay. Well, give me a second while I deal with my eyes for some reason. All of a sudden. Seek help with language. Might as well. My knowledge of Korvax convergence increases. Beautiful. Didn't catch what word I learned because my glasses were off. But it's fine. Whatever word I learned, I'm sure it'll be helpful. Also, what the hell is this thing? This thing. This kind of looks like a geck head. Kind of looks like a geck head. Interesting. Very interesting. Alright. Then there's... I'm presuming a uh, knowledge stone down here. Somewhere. Ah, there it is. Okay, cool. Alright. Something is really up with my eyes today. I don't know what's up. Give me a second. I'll try and figure it out. Weird. It's like all of a sudden there's like all the dust in the world is going into my eyes and I can't like fight it back. I don't understand it. But it doesn't matter because we are done with everything on this planet as far as I'm concerned. Not much else I need to do. 
rather than get this thing's oxygen. There we go. And get the dihydrogen from here. And then I noticed this thing here. Little shit. Get the carbon and oxygen out of this. And finish up the harvesting with the dihydrogen. Alright. And we're good. Okay. And now we head out. I think we've done everything I need to on this planet. Now that I'm in space, yep, I'm able to talk to Artemis again. When I first reached out to the heavens, I had no idea what to expect. The beauty, the mystery, the adventure, the danger. And here we are, aren't we? Go to a hollow terminus. Upload your data. Let's find each other. Okay. I'll locate a hollow terminus to send the data. Also, a whole bunch of frigates kind of dropped out of space here. Interesting. Any chance I can... Oh, I can. I can recruit a few of them. Interesting. Alright, let's talk to you. Okay. My bad. There we go. Talk to them. Hey, <laughs> the Traveler. Do you wish us to join your fleet? My vessel and those who currently inhabit it are yours to command. Our vessel shall be yours, Traveler. Okay, well let's... Oh! Boy, oh boy, oh boy. That is a very, very, very high class industrial specialist that I could in no way, shape, or form afford to bring on. Wowzers. Um, they are very good, though. They are extremely good. I just can't afford them. <laughs> like, at all. Okay, well. It's fine. That is perfectly fine. Alright, um. So now I think about it. Let's bring my frigate closer to me. There we go. Well, there we go. Beautiful. Well, one ship's back, which makes me think I can uh, check on the rest of them. Man, my eyes just keep on watering. I can't blink enough to get them to stop. It's insane. Ah. <sighs> Okay, after I check on the ships that I sent on that expedition, I think I'm going to end the episode because my eyes just keep acting up and I need to let some air in or something. I don't know. Something to get... Fucking, I don't know what's going on. Alright. Here we go. Fleet Command. Debrief Commander. Okay. Surveying planet Dacus 28L1 when encountered smugglers engaged in poaching operation. Got some units for uh, scattering poachers. Got some chromatic metal. Did some mining. Good. Albumen, albumen pearls. Okay. Cool. Some more units. Activated indium. Interesting. Didn't expect something like that. Alrighty then. Alrighty. Well, since I'm in here, grab these. Grab these. Okay. Antimatter housing. Didn't expect to pick that up, but okay. Um, did I have a place to store these? I did not. 
Interesting. Huh. Well, I probably should. Just don't know where. Um, yeah, put it here. Why not? Um, put this here, I guess. Put this... Yeah, put this here. Lemium. I think I know where I want to put this. I think I know, anyway. Right here. That's good. And the rest of this I just want to sell. So, we'll go with that. Yeah. That's good. It's good enough. Alright. I'm also going to recharge this real quick. And we're good. Hmm. Actually, okay, I had chromatic metal here, so I can just move this to my ship. Cool. Indium. I'll just put this in with copper. There we go. Cool. Better. And then I will put this on me and put this here. Cool. Um, anything else? Radon. Where do I put the radon? Curious. Here, I guess. Yeah, let's put it here. I don't see why not. Um, put that there. Cool. And I think that is everything I want to do. Forgot to put this back into my exosuit. Silly me. Then put that there, and we're good. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, put this on me this on me. Put these in my freighter. Cool. And then I'm done. Perfect. Alright. I think that covers everything I needed it to cover. Nice. Alright. And with that, I think I will end the episode. Yeah. Because there's nothing else I can do without getting off my frigate. And I still need to figure out why the hell my eyes are acting up so bad. But, uh, anyway. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so I can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games and trying to figure out where Artemis is while also kind of running around the same solar system for the time being, but it'll be a matter of time before we are a little closer to figuring out where he's at. We just need to head to a hollow terminus and uh, figure out where to go from there for you.